Every time I hear an AI voiceover, I can tell instantly. It sounds flat, robotic, and fake. But I'm finally sharing the secret I've been using in my own videos to make AI voices sound completely human. And it's helped me create videos like this one that pulled in over 170,000 views. And it's how I've been able to stay consistent and more than double my followers every month since I started. But here's the crazy twist. What you just heard wasn't even me. That was my professional AI voice clone, and I bet you couldn't tell. Let's face it, sometimes you just don't feel like setting up a mic and recording. Being able to type a script and get a professional sounding voice instantly is a huge advantage when you don't have the time to record. The problem is up until now, AI voices still sounded fake. Viewers notice right away and it hurts the content's credibility and performance. So after testing dozens of tools, I finally found one that's almost indistinguishable from my real voice. I'm talking about Eleven Labs' new Pro Voice feature. Eleven Labs already had some of the best voice clones in the game, but Pro Voice is on another level compared to the quick clones most people are using. It's what I've been using to consistently publish across multiple platforms and generate tens of thousands of views. Let's jump in and I'll show you how easy it is to set up and use. To get started, just click the link below and you'll be taken to the Eleven Labs website and then just click on pricing. And with my link, you're gonna get 10,000 free credits per month and that lets you use some of the basic features. So with this plan, you can't clone your voice, but you can use a lot of high quality pre-built voices. They do have it in a number of languages and you can do a number of other things as you see here. But to use the pro voice clone feature, we do need the creator plan and you're actually gonna get 50% off your first month with my link. So that's gonna be around 11 bucks. This starter plan only has the instant voice clone, which isn't bad, but we're gonna be using, we need the professional voice clone, which is the best, it's the one I showed you. So that's the plan we need. So just hit get started. So once you've gone through the quick setup, you'll be here in your dashboard and we're gonna now create your professional voice. So click on voices and then you're gonna go to create or clone a voice. And so you'll see you have a number of different options. So you can do the instant voice clone, which is okay. And later in the video, I'll show you the difference between the instant clone and the professional clone so you can really see how much better the professional clone is and so the instant clone isn't bad and the good thing about this one though is you only need 10 seconds to about two minutes of audio a minimum of 10 seconds but we want to use is the professional voice clone and with this one you need at least 30 minutes of audio and preferably two hours so I've already created my professional voice clone so I can't create another one but once you click this here's what it's going to look like so you'll be taken to this screen you can name your voice you can give it some languages and you can then add some labels if you want to organize things or to give the model a little bit more information about yourself like this as you can see but the important part is to upload your samples so you can go upload samples and what you want to do is each sample you upload until you get to two hours it's just going to keep filling up so you want to get as close to two hours as possible because that's when you're going to give it the most amount of data to train on you which is going to make it the most realistic sounding voice clone. So 30 minutes is the minimum, but you want to get as close to two hours as possible. Now, the way I did this and a bit of a hack is I didn't want to sit here and record two hours of new audio. So all I did was go and pull all my previous content I've made. I picked a bunch of good clips, just stripped out the audio and just uploaded, as you can see, a few files and that added up to two hours pretty easily. So that's a bit of a trick there. You don't have to record a two hour podcast by yourself for something right now in order to get a good quality clone. Just use some of the content you've already made. So once the system has created your professional voiceover, you'll actually see it under my voices and you can preview it. Something ready made, it comes from your own actions. And that sounds like me, which is really cool. Now, I wanna show you the difference between a professional voice and a standard voice. And so let's hop over to text-to-speech and here's that intro you saw at the top of the video. And I wanna show you the difference. First, let's start with a regular voice. So this is using the standard quick clone feature, which is only like 10 seconds to two minutes. And I'll play it here. So Every time I hear an AI voiceover, I can tell instantly it sounds flat, robotic, and fake. But I'm finally sharing the secret I've been using in my own videos to make AI voices sound completely human. And it's helped me create videos like- Sounds okay 
but I can kind of tell it's AI. Like it's good, it's better than all the other models out there, but it still sounds a little bit artificial. Now let's use my pro voice instead. Every time I hear an AI voiceover, I can tell instantly. It sounds flat, robotic, and fake. But I'm finally sharing the secret I've been using in my own videos to make AI voices sound completely human. And you can just hear like the antonation in my voice. You can kind of hear me breathing. You can just hear those subtle differences between the previous one and this one that just really masks that it's AI. It's not 100% perfect, of course, but you know, we're sitting here in a setting where you know it's an AI voice and I'm telling you it's an AI voice. So you're trying to listen for the tiniest thing here. But imagine in a scenario where no one is even thinking it's an AI voice. No one would ever be able to tell. And so that's why this pro voice is so much better. And I want to share a few tips for how I optimize my pro voice. I like to make it a little bit faster so you can see it just a little bit faster and that's maybe just more like the way I speak but I also find just speaking faster makes it less noticeable that it's AI um, and you can play around with some of these other factors too but that's just one thing to experiment with that I would recommend and you can also try the multilingual model and the 2.5 flash model as well to see what you like better every time I hear an AI voiceover I can tell instantly it sounds flat robotic and fake but I'm finally sharing this so you get the idea right so you can play around, see which models you like. This one also has style exaggeration, which you can play with, which also lets you really fine tune your AI voice until you get it exactly how you like it. Now, here comes the fun part. How do you actually use your AI voice? Well, I'm gonna show you a bunch of different ways you can use it. And a lot of them are brand new with 11 Lab Studio 3. It's super exciting stuff. I can't wait to show you. So the first thing we can do, of course, like you just saw is text to speech. You can just type type anything in here, hit generate, and you can get realistic sounding speech just like that. And then when you're ready, you can just hit download and it's gonna download it for you, pretty simple. And then you can use it in whatever composition you're using it in. Next, you can get 11 labs to narrate any web page you give it. So for example, let's say I wanted to narrate this page right here about me. So I just gave it that URL and I just hit play and it'll start generating it. About me, solopreneur. Hey, I'm Kevin Fernando, entrepreneur, content creator, and growth marketer. I help SaaS companies and entrepreneurs scale small. You get it, right? So very cool. If you wanted to kind of narrate a specific web page or something else like that online, you can definitely do that with literally one click. Next, let's turn a PDF guide into an audiobook. So just hit new audiobook, drag in a PDF guide you have, and just hit create project. And it will start processing. Let me show you the guide I'm talking about. So this is a a 40 page guide I have here um, that you can grab actually for free if you'd like. I'll drop in the description down below if you're interested. Let it process. And just like that, it's transcribed everything. And again, you can set up your professional voice and hit play. And if you wanted to, by the way, you don't have to use your own voice. You can just choose from any, How to make money any voice you want. No time. Passive income shortcuts, Kevin Fernando. How to make money online with no time and a tiny budget. Passive income shortcuts, Kevin Fernando. Solopreneurtools.io expert guide. You don't know this about me, but I actually have a time machine. So you get the idea. It can actually read out your entire audiobook, And of course, you should cut out things that are not relevant. So if you just edit it, like you're editing a Word document, then the system's not gonna read it. So of course you need to go through your document and clean it up so it makes sense in audio form because all it's done is it's actually taken all the content and is reading it out. So make sure you make the changes that make it make sense for an audio book. But once you edit it, just like you're editing a Word document, boom, just like that, you can get a complete audio book. And if you wanted to, you could even sell this on Amazon. Next, let me show you how you can actually turn anything into a podcast. Like let's turn this blog post I wrote into a podcast. So just go create a podcast and I like to use import URL and there, and this time I'm not gonna use myself. Let's actually use some different voices. And what's cool is it's actually two people because a podcast is more engaging when they talk to each other. Let me show you what I mean. So you just pop in your URL, you choose your voices and you hit generate. And so the voices I'm using are some of the pre-built voices they provide. And you'll see they're super high quality. So once it's generated, you can just hit play. You know what keeps me up 
at night. The fact that 87% of international business contracts are basically handshake deals done through PayPal, and most people have no idea they're one dispute away from disaster. That's a pretty alarming statistic. What made you start looking into this? Well, I recently heard about this friend who got completely blindsided when their overseas developer essentially stole their entire app. We're talking about a six figure. So you get the idea right there. And if you read um, this blog post right here, you'll get that it took a lot of the story beats and everything I highlighted here, and it just made it into a podcast. It's absolutely crazy. And there's just so much more you can do. If you make a mistake in one of your videos, you can actually use this feature here, which just corrects that one word or phrase so what happens is you actually just upload your video and then let's say this was actually Queen Street not King Street you would just type it and it would actually change it for you or if you upload a video and it doesn't even have a voiceover you can actually add a voiceover just type what you want to say use your own voice and you can add a voiceover to your videos if you didn't originally record a voiceover and there's so many more things you can do within here as you can see and one other way I've been using my pro voice is by combining it with an ultra realistic AI avatar clone of myself. Together, this lets me create complete videos without ever being on camera or recording my own voice. And those videos still pull in tens of thousands of views. That's beyond the scope of this tutorial, but I have a complete masterclass that walks you through the exact system I use step by step to grow consistently across multiple platforms. If that's something you'd like to check out, just drop a comment below and I'll send you more info. So that's how I've been using 11 Labs Pro Voice to create AI voices that sound completely human. You can get started with the link below. You'll get 10,000 free credits to test it out, plus 50% off your first month of the creator plan, which gives you access to the pro voice feature. If you found this video helpful, do me a favor and hit that like button and consider subscribing to the channel for more content just like this. In fact, check out this video right here if you want another AI tool that can help you get more done faster. I'll see you in the video.